Hey, hey guys, check this out. There's a lot of videos going around right now with the uh, this new stems and showing one F1, but I'm showing two F1s. And there's a reason why I'm showing two F1s working with the stems, because in my opinion, it's the best way to run them. Because when you try to switch over and go over to that deck and start to run things, um, depending where your volume faders are, they're not going to be the same. You know what I mean? So you have, as soon as you touch it, it does a soft takeover and it's just not smooth at all. So let me just demonstrate these things. If you haven't seen these things, these are awesome. And I'm gonna show you, the idea is that you wanna be able to not just mix the four here, but the four stems over here, back and forth between them all, right? I can just like drop this out there's a baseline I'm gonna filter this one down and then bring it in Actually, one of the things here I'm just going to take the vocal out so I can talk See, I just turned it down, I can mute it off Or turn it down But I'm currently running this with a DDJ SX2 mapping And I think somehow with everything going, my filters on these knobs aren't working up here but on the S4, they work fine. So that's just a free warning. We'll go more into that later. Also too, when you hold shift, this row here, just like on the F1, allows you to affect what channel you want, right? So I want to affect the vocal. I'm gonna do a freeze echo deal. Turn on the vocal, turn off my freeze echo. Get rid of that freeze echo.
still got that aqua going. Check that out. That's a little delay going right there with post fader effect. You know what? Song again and so. You know what? Why don't we just end the video like that? That's the problem with these things, man. You can go on and on and on. Like, there's no end to the creativity of these things. Stems are the future of DJing. I'm surprised they didn't come out this a long time ago. The remix decks, eh, they weren't the best things in the world. They were cool, just they weren't, they didn't have the, the content. That's the problem. Now, we got all these record labels on board. We've got the content, man. There's a lot of songs out there being released like this. And uh, to all you artists and producers out there, seriously, this should give you a brand new uh, take on how you make your music, knowing that people are going to be able to interact with you know, multi-track mixing with your stuff. The future looks good for DJing, guys. Talk to you later.